Shifting gears now, tonight tennis is taking center stage here in Lincoln. There is a competition underway pitting the best of the sport against one another. All the action is happening at the University Sid and Hazel Dillon Tennis Center, welcoming women from around the world. 1011's Kendall Lanier has a story. For the first time in history, Nebraska is hosting a professional women's tennis tournament, giving both collegiate and professional players a chance to showcase their talents with prize money awarded to the winners. Players from around the world are serving up the intensity right here in Lincoln. It's a great opportunity. Um, of course, I want to do well. Anna Zambarek, a senior tennis player at Nebraska, originally from the Dominican Republic, is headed back home for two pro tournaments and is using this one as a warm up. This is actually the first pro tournament I played outside of my country. So I was like, and it's like here in Lincoln, which is like my second home. So it kind of, it feels weird. Athletes from the U.S., Great Britain, Kenya, Germany, Egypt, China, and Japan have made their way to the capital city. I mean, just getting, getting into these tournaments is hard enough. So being able to play somebody who's played Wimbledon every year, who's played main draw, like it's just so cool to be able to do that as a college player. This comes after Nebraska hosted a men's tennis tournament back in August. For us to be able to host not only a professional men's tournament, but now a women's tournament, literally just months apart um, has been an amazing blessing, um, not only for the tennis community, but for, for Lincoln. With the new exposure surrounding Nebraska women's tennis, they hope it will rally even more people to the program. I think it's just a great opportunity to highlight uh, women's athletics and for the folks to be able to come out and see these amazing athletes. Um, it's just another step in continuing to develop. There's still time to come and see the action. The tournament will run until this Sunday. Reporting from the SIT in Hazel Dillon Tennis Center, Kendall Lanier, 11 News.